Hi, I'm Danny Duran. And I'm Kathleen Gibbs. And welcome to Horizon News Networks. This week, we're going to be talking about the controversy that Sister Cindy brought to GCSU campus. Along with this, we're going to have Sam and Keith talking to us about the sports, including Jason Kelsey's upcoming retirement and what is to come from that. Along with this, we're going to have John talking to us about this week's upcoming weather. And after that, we're going to talk about the troubles on GCSU camping with parking. Now, on to Sam and Keith with sports. I'm Sam. I'm Keith. And this is Sports News. Philadelphia Eagles star Jason Kelsey addressed reports on Wednesday that he announced his retirement after the loss to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, saying on his podcast that in the future something will be said. Reportedly, he announced his retirement in the locker room to his teammates after the 32-9 loss to the Bucks. It was a great weekend for football fans as the NFL had its championship rounds. It was a tough day for Lamar Jackson as the Chiefs beat the Ravens 17-10. Patrick Mahomes finished 30 for 39 with 241 passing yards and one touchdown. Meanwhile, the 49ers beat the Lions in a comeback win, 31 to 24. The Niners were able to claw back into the lead and now face the Chiefs in the Super Bowl. That's all we have today for sports news. On to John with the weather. I'm John, and I'm here for your weekly weather forecast. We're expecting a moderately chilly week, so get ready to bundle up. We're expecting temperatures in, with the low in the mid-30s, but it should warm up with highs in the mid-60s by the end of the week. We're expecting sunny skies nearly all the week, but it, we're ex also expecting a little bit of rain on Sunday, which could extend on to Monday. So it'll be a perfect week for any, all those outdoor weekend plans that you may have. Now on to Kathleen for last week's campus controversy. Recently, GCSU students got news that TikTok sensation Sister Cindy would be coming to campus to give one of her very famous speeches. Tons and tons of students gathered on the front lawn to see what she had to say. As she went on about her speech, many students found it very funny and were laughing along and even cheering for her. However, as the day went on, some students found what she was saying very offensive and hurtful and felt that she was going about it in the wrong way. Some even brought up their Bibles and were throwing verses at her as she was throwing them back. As we, even with everything going on, Sister Cindy stood her ground and did what she does best. But here is a video example of what was going on. Well, can I turn it down? No, ma'am, you can't use it. I've been letting you use it until somebody complained, and somebody complained. Well, anybody can complain. You got to put it up. Yeah. They're all like they're listening. How are they going to hear? Yeah. Come on. Come on. I'm sorry, you gotta put it up. Why? Because you're not supposed to have it in the first place. Well, I give you this much until somebody complains. So what? Wow, that was crazy. Now on to Danny with a quick story about the trials that GCSU parking brings to the students. Thanks, Kathleen. Now on parking at GCSU campus. There have been many, many problems about parking on GCSU campus for many years. Students claim to have trouble finding parking on campus even if they leave early for class. I know personally, I've had a lot of trouble with this, and sometimes it takes me up to five times around campus simply to find a spot, which makes me late for class. Hopefully one day we'll be able to create more parking on campus, allowing students to get to class on time. That's all I have. Thank you for tuning in to Horizon News Network. I'm Kathleen Gibbs. And I'm Danny Duran. Have, Have a, a great, great day. day.